Have you ever fallen into a pool? Like you're just hanging out, chilling by the water, when suddenly, whoops, because I have. I'm really clumsy. I can't count the amount of times I've hit my head, fallen, or ran into something. The other day when I was finishing up my therapy session, I crouched down to get in the car, but instead I bonked my head on the door. I was in so much pain that I kneeled over and I couldn't get up. My mom tried to make me feel better, saying it was because the car was at a slant, but I swear we've parked in that angle before. I'm pretty sure it's me that's the problem. The car and the road slant are innocent. There was a bump on my head for a few days because of that. And to make matters worse, throughout the week I continued to bump my head on things. I've also fallen out of the car. I would assume you would get out of the car the same way every time. But for some reason, my subconscious thought of trying a new method. I have a terrible fear of heights, and these are the reasons why. I can never walk near the mall's second floor railings or ride a Ferris wheel because I know, somehow, I'll be the one to find a way to fall off. I remember the time we went to Hershey Park and while everyone was going on the rides, I just stayed back because I couldn't stand the idea of falling off. Because I knew I would. Eventually, my mom wanted to go on the kissing tower and since I couldn't be left alone, I had no choice but to go with. For those who don't know, the kissing tower is a cylinder that slowly goes high up and spins very slowly when it reaches the top. It's a very safe ride with Hershey Kiss shaped windows and railings, so you're not leaning on the glass. There's pretty much no way you could fall or get hurt, but fear has a way of making you believe in the impossible. Like maybe I just happened to walk over to the door, and it just happened to be unlocked, and I just happened to be the person to fall out. I felt the same way when you'd go on the swing ride. I don't know the name, but you'd go in a swing and it felt very strong. I thought it would break and I'd go flying. Just me, by the way. Everyone else would be fine. I somehow would be the only one to break the swing just by being on it. It's been so bad before that I had to go to the hospital. Twice. The first time, I was about four and I tried running across the road but fell on a rock. The second time, I was running in a garage and fell into a nail. Yeah, don't run in garages. It's not too visible, but the scar is still there. I've gotten scars doing other stupid things before. I once went swimming at a lake with my cousins and their kids. At one point, I swam too close to the bottom and managed to cut my nose on a rock. I was fine, though. I think bonking my head on the car door actually hurt more than getting cut. Besides, the medic, or someone at some point, I can't remember who, told me my nose scar looked pretty cool. You know what, being clumsy and falling and getting really hurt, it's not so bad as long as someone thinks you're cool.